So I just got done obviously with my workout you guys saw and um, I wanted to show you guys a new fitness tracker that I, that was gifted to me by my aunt um, she uh, got me a fitness tracker from happy planner take a look at it so I'm going to be planning and tracking my progress in this planner this is a two-year planner it started in July of um 2020 of this year um obviously it's not july it's october but it goes all the way to december 21st i mean december 25th december 2021 is what it goes to so i'm going to show you guys my planner the front cover says um you can and you will which is so true because this 100 day challenge i can do this and i will do this um and then i think i'm just gonna go like this okay and then when you open it up you obviously are going to see this is in every happy planner you're going to see the welcome note from the ceo and founder of happy planner and then the first quote you're going to see is strong women lift each other up and this is the fitness edition look how cute they are so oops this is not what's next the next you're, next you're going to see um the two year spread so you have 2020 you have 2021 here but this next list here or this next page here um starts in july um but i will be starting here because it's october so i won't be using this page so i'll be starting here i don't know about you guys but i am all about the vertical life okay like some people like the horizontal planners but I found very quickly when I started um, using heavy planners that I'm about that vertical ver vertical life. So comment below if you are a vertical babe, like let me know because vertical babes unite. <laughs> so you have the whole um, year and a half basically a vertical layout here all the way to December. And then you start with the month. I'm actually going to skip to October. Um, because it doesn't make sense to go through July and August if those days have already passed. So here is October here. And the first thing you're going to see is this quote, wake up beauty, beauty. It's time to beast with this photograph here, or this picture here. And then off to the side, you guys, you're going to see um, this kind of monthly summary spread here. So the first at the top it says celebrate each little victory and this is where i'm going to write my victories for the month like the month of october so if i lost weight this month or if my pants are fitting better or if i worked out each day this month or you know if i didn't skip any days this is where i will write it here and then off to the side next to that you have dates and holidays and they already give you the um, national dates and holidays and um, down at the bottom, you have uh, a dotted section where you can reflect on this month. So you're gonna see that on every single, um, every single like new new month. And then let's go to the next page. You have your monthly spread here, and then you go into your weekly spread. So they already give you the month and the dates at the top with the days of the week. And then again, this is a vertical spread. So you are going to be working vertically. So they give you a section that says today. Now this is where I'm gonna be writing my to-do list when it comes to my um, journey to better health. So today, like for here, I'll put maybe workout or um, meet my sister at the gym or um, plan meal plan or meal prep or things like that go to the grocery store things like that will go in this section and then the next session section says focus this is where i will put things that i want to focus on for that day so maybe that day i want to drink a gallon of water or i want to make sure i work out at 6 a.m that morning 
or um, I want to make sure I meal prep that'll be my focus or editing a fitness vlog maybe that's my focus for that day and then after that I'm going to be logging my food so my breakfast lunch dinner any snacks that I may have I'm going to log them here and then um, exercise I will be putting the exercise that I had that I did that day will go in this section here okay now um this i love where it says exercise i love this section because um sometimes you forget the exercises that you be doing throughout the week like seriously so let's say monday i did cardio this day i did upper body this day i did core and you get to this day of the week and you're like okay so what am i doing for the rest of the week you can look back on what you've already tracked and you can say oh i haven't done upper body so i need to do upper body on saturday or sunday or wednesday you know or thursday so it's always good to track you guys so you can see your progress throughout the week and throughout the month so um if you guys want to see more videos of me planning and tracking what i'm doing be sure to give this video a big like be sure to comment down below say yes melissa i want to see you put that planner into action it seems really cool let me know and i will produce those videos for you guys but um y'all it's day three and so far i'm feeling great um i honestly have lost some weight <laughs> since the beginning of this challenge which is i'm like mind blown um there's only been three days so um i'm excited for the rest of the week and the rest of this challenge and what it has to bring hey guys it is day five of the 100 day challenge and i just finished my workout for day five it's quite early in the morning it's about 5 8 uh not 5 a.m but like 6 a.m uh today's workout was so relaxing it was so nice uh, we did stretching it was like yoga inspired um, and it just felt really really good to just stretch after working out all week